Her first hit, Everybody, was written by friend Stephen Bray, who is also a member of her band. Madonna managed to get a recording of the song to New York producer Mark Kamins. Madonna saw her first song on the dance charts in 1982, when Everybody hit number one. Madonna wanted to capitalize on the song's success, and she managed to convince Sire Records to produce a full-length album. Uh, Madonna first signed with a, a record label called Gotham Records, and um, she was in the music building one day and just skipping along through the hallway, and there was this guy in the elevator, and she, you know, Madonna knew that flirtation got you places, so there was this guy that looked kind of important. She was like, you look like John Lennon. and. It turns out that he was working at this record company, and that's and he liked what he saw, so he introduced Madonna to um, Camille Barbone, who was going to be her first manager. And she asked her, "Do you know any way of which, you know, do you know of any way that I can further my career?" And she said, "Well, first, I'm going to get you out of that place." So Camille not only was her manager and gave her songs to put on that were a lot more poppy and less punky, but she also sort of gave her a place to stay and like food to eat. She was kind of homeless, sort of a vagabond. Madonna, her first record, was produced in 1983. Although the album was not an immediate success, as it gained attention, it continued to climb the charts. The first album that started it all was called Madonna, and it came out in 1983. And um, that album was that was the like the first step on the on the staircase. It was the the album that took her and the record label label that took her from being a struggling artist. And that song has Holiday... Uh